up divas and divos it's your girl april so today's video is of course going to be a hair tutorial so before we even get into that i want you guys to know that i have worked three times previous with this company they do have some great hair it's affordable hair i'm not going to say it's going to last for eternity especially because it's just hair but they do have some really nice affordable hair so because this is the month of march they are celebrating their anniversary promotion so they are having like a really great sale and i will link all of the information below for you guys so this is called the sore hair and this time around they did send me their natural wave um i did get three bundles it's super long 222s a 20 and a 20 inch closure so normally i do like four bundles but three bundles was just enough and it's very wavy it's like wavy wavy it could use a little bit more waves to it but you know that's why i got my curling barrel because we're gonna hook it up as best as possible it is a closure i went ahead and i did bleach the knots in the unit and i did forget to sew in the combs but it is what it is we're going to just get past all of that. But I did bleach the closure. But I'm still going to use some of my pressed powder for this video. So we're going to jump right into this real quick. So that way we can just get into the tutorial. All right, guys. So we're going to make this really quick. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just take my pressed powder with a really dense makeup brush. And I'm going to spread that over the closure on the inside. I'm going to also spray some hairspray just so that powder can set. And then I'm going to go back over it once again with some more powder. And I did spray it again as well. So time is now it's time to style it. Unfortunately, I forgot the combs in this unit. And it does look a little bit darker at the part area. And that's because of my cap underneath. Plus, my cap does have a little bit of makeup on it. So so this wave unit is more or less like a natural wave. It isn't really wavy as I would like it to be wavy. So I'm just going to do something really, really quick. If you don't have a lot of time on hand, but you want some beach waves or some loose curls, you can definitely take a wand curler. I would suggest getting a smaller barrel, nothing too big. The barrel shouldn't be more than an inch. It definitely shouldn't even be an inch. This is the one that's thicker at the top and slender at the bottom. And what I do to achieve these curls, these loose curls are these kind of like waves like or more or less these like curls I just as soon as I wrap the entire hair on the barrel I take it right off so I just wrap it all the way on and I just take it right off as you guys see you don't want the curl too tight because it will make the hair shorter plus it'll just give it a different type of style and it also lay differently so if you don't want them too tight I would suggest just pulling it right off as soon as you finish wrapping it around the barrel depending on how long the hair is if the hair is shorter you may not want to do that you may want to count like probably like three seconds or two seconds but because the hair is lengthy by the time I've wrapped the entire hair on the entire barrel it has curled also I do have my barrel curl or up to 450 degrees which is the highest temperature that it can go I love this curling barrel because it is by irresistible me and I have been using this for a couple of years now it does come with a interchangeable wand so that is the reason why you see me use it a lot so as for the hair texture it's soft it's very low luster so it's not so shiny which I'm glad about because I can't not stand when certain hair is just like too shiny. If it's got like this really, really high sheen to it, it just tends to not hold a great curl and it just is flatter. It's not as thick and full. So I do like low luster hair a lot better because you just are able to get like a more, more or less like a more body from it. It curls easy. Their hair is really affordable. This is the fourth video that I've done for them. They have a two year anniversary promotion sale going on, which is great. Um, and also you do um, get a $5 discount if you are a new customer. So I would definitely make sure to register on the website so that way you can get $5 off. Who does not like a discount? But yeah, so this natural wave is really cute. It's long, it's three bundles. Normally I'll do four for like a long texture like this especially because I just like a lot of hair but the three bundles was actually just enough okay and like when I say just enough it was probably like an inch left of weaving hair so now that I'm going to go ahead I'm going to take some of my front hair perimeters out because like I said it is a closure and I'm just going to situate it I really do wish that I had some combs in it but it is what it is I'm not going to be using my Gorilla Snot Gel in this video only because I'm trying to let my edges grow back so I'm using this gel called Touchdown it's more or less really greasy 
I would describe it as like that jam um, gel. That's what I would more or less describe it as. It may not work for everyone, but it does hold my edges down to a certain extent, which is great. So it's not so hard. And the stuff that you did see me spraying into my hair is called um, Boldify, which helps me have edges, you know, gives me a little bit of edges. So yes, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So let's stay tuned for the finished look. easy curl for waves if you want to get your waves back you just have to just as soon as you put it all on the barrel just take it right off it's that simple you don't have to leave it on the barrel just quickly take it right off and the waves will come popping like this I turned mine up to 450 degrees because I love my curling iron to be like super hot but for the most part I love the low luster in this hair because it just looks more natural I don't like when it's too silky looking or too lustrous looking because it just seems to tend to not catch as much body as opposed to like a lot of units that have like more coarser textures so it's not really really silky silky straight like that like so thin and fine but it is kind of like in between I do like this hair it's really cute it's long it's sexy it's you know wavy it's your beachy waves this is supposed to be like their natural wave but to me this is more or less like a loose wave a beach wave you know something really really relaxed this I think looks really nice with like a maxi dress some summer heat you know vacation type hair you know like water type here throw on your bathing suit and look really really cute type here so as I said this is the Brazilian natural wave in 22 22 20 and a 20 inch closure and the bundles are rather long so I think like three bundles will definitely be enough if you're getting 22 and above if you're getting anything longer I would definitely suggest doing like four bundles so you guys I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial make sure you check the links up below for their anniversary sale and on that note I love you guys stay diva and delicious make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up share with all your social, social media friends and family and on that note I'll see you guys soon